Macquarie. Thank you. Recently, the member for Hawkesbury has discussed the importance of heritage. Here's what he said. Our heritage buildings and places tell the story of New South Wales, and that's something we have a responsibility to safeguard and maintain for generations to come. The Lysicrates Monument represents the rich cultural history and heritage that's shaped our city, our state and our nation. There is also vital work to be done, maintaining and preserving heritage assets like the Piermont Bridge. Great, I thought. Here's someone who might actually help protect and preserve the oldest public square in the country in his own electorate. But no, he's happy to wax lyrical about heritage in the New South Wales Parliament and invest millions in the CBD. But not one mention of Thompson Square on his Facebook page or in a media release. Instead, he claims as an achievement the planned construction of a replacement Windsor Bridge, which will run through Thompson Square and will irrevocably change it, wrecking its Georgian integrity. Mr Perrottet, who is the Finance Minister in New South Wales, had some choice words about me in Parliament, but rather than respond to schoolboy insults, I think I'd prefer to focus on content. Mr Perrottet claimed a number of achievements. Windsor Bridge, not built. A $3 million tourism investment, not delivered yet. Pitt Town Bypass, not built. A new hospital at Rouse Hill, not in his electorate. I know he gets confused. He doesn't live in the Hawkesbury, uh, but it isn't built. Now, what